So yesterday I did my FIFA tier list video, which I do each year, and I said in there that FIFA 16 is completely forgettable. So, in response to that, to make sure I secure my point, let's play FIFA 16. Tell me down below in the comments what's your thoughts on 16. Did you even play 16? Did you have like a favorite memory from 16? Certain career modes say, a certain player on all team that you used to love. This was still in the era of you can have like a normal like 10k team and still smash teams up to bits. So this was the beautiful part of FIFA back in this era. And you're going to see this by the players I'm going to show you here. And also a reason why is because I believe that the servers will end up being put down of this game within the next few months. Last year, FIFA 15 servers were indeed put down. It pisses me off to this day. So, of course, you can't go back on your FIFA 15 teams and your 14 teams, your 13. That makes me so sad. 16, you can still go on, though, um, which I'm sure everyone's happy about. I don't know. Maybe people still play this game. I don't know. Maybe I can find a game. Can I find a game? Let's find out. But yeah, let's get stuck in and let's go. Yo, do you play FIFA 22? Yeah. Is your team bang average? You absolute pathetic piece of... You're saying that to the viewers? No, obviously. Ah, okay. I mean you. Do you face teams like this? You can't keep getting away with it! Do you know there's a way to get coins? Why are you shouting at me? <laughs> then go to usurvive.com for the cheapest and most reliable place to buy your coins on FIFA 22. Link is down below in the description. And also use code VISA at checkout to get a discount. FIFA 16. I've done like 14 and like 19 and 17, but never 16. I just, it never comes to mind. So, here we go. FIFA 16. I do like the kind of color scheme. It's really in your face. The light blues. It's really, you know, high contrast kind of stuff. It looks quite crisp. It's crispy. I like it very crispy. EA Sports. And then there's the green triangle thing. I don't know why. On this year, they had this weird color scheme graphic branding of like the greens with the blues, but it had like some triangle. I don't know what's the word for it, like destruction effect. Like it all can like you know falls to pieces and tears apart. I don't know. That, that was like the main like graphics of this game. I also remember for this FIFA, there was like some weird like play beautiful Pele like trailer as well. Sport returns for another year of drama. Falcao! Falcao, yeah, at Chelsea, you, you mad! Nice little song. My love, so strong. And this is when we had the new camp as well. I actually forget nowadays that we don't even have the new camp, like, in FIFA anymore. The first time women's football, uh, like, women footballers were put in the game. And I don't think they've added anything to that since they added this back in 16. So they added foot draft to this game. They also added in women's football to this game, which I think people tried once and then never tried it ever again. I don't even notice it anymore. They don't even attempt to even, like, promote it, I feel it feels like. Aren't I banned on this account? I think this used to be my second account, but now it's my main account. Yeah, so so back in 16, I did um, the Fatal series, uh, which was part of Bateson's Fatal series. And I bought coins to, like, you know, get actual coins for my account because I didn't put money in the game. Halfway through the series, my account got banned of Fatal, and I completely sh myself completely because I thought, oh my god, I can no longer, like, take part in Fatal. And it was, like, a big moment for me. A guy that my brother knew, who's a Burnley fan, who, he was, like, an aspiring, like, pro player, so he had, like, an account with, like, a million or so coins that I can, like, still build a team. Only one issue, I remembered, and I'm gonna put it on screen here, but the name of my account was, um, you're gonna see it on screen here. It's not ideal. It really is not ideal. Like, imagine me being in, like, a series with people that doesn't know who I am, and then they look at me, and they see my team name is, you know. Yeah, I had that as my team name, so that's the reason. If people still remember that, that's the reason why. So, let's go back to what was my main account back in these days. So, of course, what you can see is the stadiums and backgrounds, so right now with the Emirates. And this is one little, like, cool feature that only appeared on this FIFA and not on any other FIFA since, which makes this kind of a unique vibe to the game, like, only this game had. And you could put any team you want in the game. So if you want to have Liverpool, for example, as your main team, there you go, pick Liverpool, and now you're at Anfield. It's only this FIFA that has this little feature, which just doesn't mean much, but it means enough. Of course, Match Day Live, this used to be like a pretty cool thing. I think they only did it for 15 and 16, I believe. Leicester was four stars as well. Four stars. Yeah, I've got to have King Power because this is the year they actually won the league. So in respect to them. 24 goals for Vardy, 17 goals. you got League Table there, and all you're going to see their power is just... Leicester's top of the league, man. And they won the league by 10 points. People forget that they won the league. They didn't scrape it. They won it by 10 points. They dominated. Seasons. Oh, I actually played seasons. I forgot I even played seasons this year. 30 wins, 2 draws, 3 losses. I didn't even, like, keep going. I just got to Division 3 and thought, I am good. Back in 
12, 13, 14. It's like the main thing. And now, it just I, I just don't really see anyone even talk about it. Pro clubs. Do I even have like a pro on this account? Um, I got Shedman Viznaldo. I'm really unfunny. I'm so sorry. Oh my god, I would have been 17 when this game came out. There's no excuse for having a name called Shedman Viznaldo at 17 years of age. To be fair, only 14 games played, but 11 goals and 12 assists. That's um, that's a good record, actually. Oh, we saw accomplishments like what it used to be. Yeah, I don't think it's like this anymore. Career mode. Okay, continue career. Let's see what's going on here then. So here's my Burnley save. So we got Ruben Lotfus cheek here. That's interesting. I'm in a Capital One Cup quarter final. We beat Chelsea 3 2. That seems quite legit, that. Colchester United is in the quarterfinals. Incredible. What's a Prem? Oh, Burnley's third. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, yeah. So on my team, I got Ian Atcho, striker, Dean Marnie, number 10, of course. Nathan Redmond, okay, that's, that makes sense to me. Um, and Marty is a CM, Lotfus Cheek, St. Just, Cerny, oh, I love Cerny. You got squad report in the old fashioned way as well, how it used to be. I like this, like, this looks like weirdly nostalgic to me. Like, when I think it is, like, layout, I think, of, like, FIFA 13. But it'll take a wild guess, I guess, that like Ronaldo is still at Real Madrid, right? Yep, of course he is. Rashford, I think, just became a thing like this year. Does not even have a face. Mbappe was not a thing either, was he? Oh my god, he was. He was 17. Actually, he was technically 16 when this first started, right? I guess I could go into a game, but I don't really want to. Oh man, I love that away kit. That away kit just always looks so nice to me. Oh, and Swansea had that. Like, awake. I don't know why that, that, that just sticks in my mind for some reason. Okay, here we go. Go to Burnley. I'm playing on Legendary. So, okay, it's not that easy of a difficulty. All right, let's go into a game. I'm not going to complete it, but at least you can, like, see the, the animations. Capital One Cup game. Burnley v Swansea. This is what you guys want for content, isn't it? I'm just curious about, like, the graphics and that. Does the graphics hold up? Of course, Martin Tyler, Anna Smith, blah, 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 blah. Ah, I didn't even see the players walk out, like, from the actual tunnel. They just spawned in. Is that supposed to be Michael Keane? Oh, my God. Oh, some of these player faces are a bit... Oh, my God. We're at Burnley. It's raining. It's, I mean, the graphics, do they still hold up? Yeah, they hold up good enough. Bafatiti Gomes. Legendary. The thing is, right, with this game, I have no idea, like, what the actual mechanics are. I have literally no idea. I don't think there really was. I think, like, maybe, like... A long shots was, I think. Nathan Redmond, here we go. Let's see how good pace is. Boom. Oh, go on. Oh, go on. Run out wide. All right, okay, I can't pass. A lot more arcadey. Like, there's not that much weight to the players. Like, it doesn't feel like there's much weight to them. They kind of just are like gliding across the pitch. Here we go. Loftus Cheek on the counter attack here. He's not got much pace, but we got D Marnie in the box. Apparently, <laughs> I, I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, no, he's offside, right? How are you not offside? Right, where does it go? Um, just not for me. Right, I'm just going to leave because I feel like I'm going to be here f literally all day and I'm not going to have a single shot. Oh, my God. Why is my next game as well Swansea? Oh, what a chew. Oh, I love that song, you know. I actually play this game quite a lot, you know, actually. This is apparently a Burnley team in the Premier League. This team should not be in Premier League. We've got Kapure at centre-back. I'm not actually playing this game. I just want to see what it looks like. Oh, the OG Premier League graphics as well. Yeah, because it was 15 that first brought in these graphics. And I think this only lasted for... I believe these two years, I don't know if 17 had this as well. So only 15 and 16 has this exact like graphics to it, which looks kind of nostalgic to me anyway. So there, here you go. Um, I'm not actually going to play this game, but there's something about player career mode that I really do enjoy. There's something that like, you can make your own like little stories and that like, oh, I'm the guy that's going to drag X team, you know, to greatness and be the main man and score 18 goals a game. Of course, I'm a striker. Like who plays player career mode and doesn't play striker? You're weird, bro. Okay, on to actual FUT, because I feel like that's why most of you guys are watching this video. And here we go. I don't know why I'm on this stadium. Okay. That's my record, which is <laughs> not good. I'll be honest, it's not that good. So I didn't really play this game that much. Like, I thought I would have played it more than what I really did. The one thing I will say about this game is the fact that th this, like, card um, design is the ugliest, ugliest design 
ever in any FIFA ever. Whose idea was it to have this as the design? It's just a complete mess. Still, the symbol looks a bit better. I like the inform card design though. I like the inform. So I got dabble. And I remember this guy, man, dabble, like. Back in these days, you could have a Dabble, or you could have a Lacazette, and they could be your boy all year. 180 games played, 134 goals. You know, I don't need any mad, like, cards to, like, enjoy the game. Um, let's just, um, get him out of the way. There you go. <laughs> well, back in these days, you could have, like, a person like Dabble, man, with, like, these stats, but he's six foot two, he's got good physicality, and he's fine. That's all you need. Genuinely, that this is all you need back in these days. Just Dabble and you... Buzzing, bro. What do I have in my club? Um, we got some lawns here, so that's the legend car design, which, um, I mean, I actually didn't mind the legend car design, to be fair. That's not that bad. I'm gonna take a wild guess that there's not really many people playing this game. Um, th that's my only team that I have, because I've got, like, no coins. Like, I don't know why I just have zero coins. Division 1 online seasons, and I, I can't play it, alright? Um, what about, um, DKTs? Um, okay, I can't play it. Um, okay, how about foot draft? Can I play at least foot draft? I, I, I think I can play foot draft. Actually, what's my history on foot draft, actually? Entire history of foot draft. Um, 25 entries. I only won it three times. Yeah, okay, that's not that good, is it? Single match? Okay, at least I could probably do this. But I highly, highly, highly doubt I'm going to find anyone playing FIFA 16. You know, I doubt it. Yeah, what a surprise. <laughs> what a surprise, lads. Right now, for the last team, you had a, a Son, 81 rated in form. You got a Roberto Firmino, left wing in form. 95 rated KDB in form. Uh, and 94 rated Higuain. 86 Everton Lukaku. Of course, the pack still is still available. Of course it is. Why would it not be? What's the pack animation again? Just do a bronze, just because I just want to see what, what it's like. I think it's the same thing. Right? So bronze pack animation. Yeah, so it's got the, like, explosion triangle effect. Remember, this was, like, proper hyped because this, like, the first year we had some sort of, like, different animation. So it was, like, really, like, hyped up when we first saw this, I remember. Can they get a bronze in form in a pack here, boys? Come on, lads. We're, we're only, like, what, six years late? I don't know why, man, but there's something just, like, cool about the fact that, okay, I now want my stadium to now be... The, the King Fad Stadium. This is also like a very popular stadium. And there you go. We're now at the King Fad Stadium. And there you go. And I think most people had this stadium too. And there's something weirdly nostalgic about the stadium backgrounds. That you can just change it. It makes it feel like it's a bit more customizable. And a bit more unique to you. Let's see what's in the market. Okay, so special cards. we got Informs, Farmers, Sun, Silvers. I think this is like the current team of the week essentially. There you go. That's more like. we got a Legends Deutsch card via 500,000 coins. Yeah, there's Latan 89 at Manchester United. I think it was he just joined. Oh my god. That's more like it. A 98 Rated team of the season, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. 1,662 games, 1,400 goals. That card was most likely absolutely nuts. And 90, Luis Suarez. Any like Messi's, Ronaldo was there, got ourselves there. A lot more team of the seasons got Van Nistelrooy, Laurent Blanc, Crespo. Even like a Crespo, like this legend card. Back in these days, just you having like a legend of any kind was like, whoa, that's nuts. Like, Having a legend, even just like a normal, normal legend was like, wow. Like I think De Boer was like a main center back that everyone had just to like say that they got a legend in their team. Even though it was like the, the worst one and the, like probably the most like pointless one, it still made it worthwhile. We've got a Ronaldo 93 rated here. God, wait, Martial. Oh, this was like the Anthony Martial year when they had like so much hype about him. I think I packed a bit of Neymar as well. And also footies. Oh, there's a footies Mandzukic too. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to play a game, but 1,100 um, live transfers in 2022 on FIFA 16. Probably more than I thought they would be, actually. I'll try one more time, but, you know, let's uh, yeah, let's try. Yep, yeah, that's a no. Tell me your thoughts on this FIFA. I, I kind of, like, I don't have bad memories to it. I just have minimal memories to it. That's my kind of thing with this game. Like, I kind of played it a little bit when I was at you know, college and I was working at McDonald's. But, like, I just didn't really, like, click with it. And because this was a perfect FIFA in between 15 and 17, it kind of gets easily put to the back because no one really rem remembers much of this game in comparison. Tell me your thoughts down below in the comments. I'll see you guys next time for another video and stay safe, boys. Bye.